We're here with head coach Jared Von Rosenberg here in Canyon, the postgame show. Lions dropped the season opener 170 to West Texas A&M. Uh, tough game to judge sometimes, but what were some of the things you liked out of the Lions today? Uh, I liked we got to the foul line. Um, it was just uh, it was just ugly. Our, uh, I, I thought defensively, it looks like we were awful defensively. I don't think we were that bad defensively. Um, we turned it over. Our offense was so poor. Which is, to be honest, to be expected. You're still hoping you can make a few more plays that don't turn into turnovers, uh, because they, you know, they had, I don't know, they had 22 points off turnovers at halftime. 30, 35 by the end. Yeah, 35 by the end, but 22 at halftime, and that that's just really hard to overcome. Obviously, give a lot of credit. WT's a, a very good basketball team. They were ready to go today, um, but it's, it's an unique opportunity for us. It's not a conference game. Um, and we needed we needed live action. I wish it was a scrimmage closed door, but uh, you know that's part of the the deal with COVID. And we got an opportunity to get on the floor, which I know our guys were excited about. Um, it hurts in that locker room. They're not very happy with uh, you know how we played and the performance on the on the scoreboard. But um, hopefully this will give us an opportunity to play better Friday and into the weekend to get a chance to get back on track. How did you feel about the uh, team chemistry and the guy, the way the guys worked together? It seemed like there was plenty of adversity in the game, but the guys kept picking each other up. Yeah, you know early in the season a lot of fouls um, both ways uh, you know a ton of free throw shot we got to the free throw line which is another positive positive. Um, and you know I thought our guys were great I thought our bench was great you know you never know uh, when you're down big you know I thought we had good energy on the bench cheering the guys that were in you know we played a lot of guys I don't know how many guys we played I believe everyone um, yeah, we played 14 guys um, just to get, you know, everybody a little taste. Because uh, I imagine early in the season this weekend, there's going to be a lot of fouls going on on both ways. That's kind of how it goes um, early in the year. Uh, but, you know, we got to get better. Uh, this team has been very good at turning around film and, and seeing what, you know, obviously what needs to be done a whole lot better. Um, but, you know, if we're able to do that, just get a little bit better on both sides of the ball, um, and, and now we got our legs under us and be able to get some practices, uh, we're, we're looking forward to a, another crack at it on Friday. If, if you take out the points off of turnovers, uh, we had nine at 35, so that's a 26-point difference. That's a four-point game yeah. right there. So outside of those runouts off of West Texas turnovers, which is what they live on for sure, when you get into that half court, it felt like a pretty even game. Yeah, we, we, we didn't finish one-on-one -on -one plays. They were able to get to the rim uncontested. Sometimes we, they were contested twos, which we want to give up. Um, they, you know, they made eight threes, and I thought a lot of them were actually guarded. So Yeah, they had a lot of step backs. You know, we, we did a decent job on some of the stuff, but, you know, all in all, when you just – you're, you're – sloppy with the basketball uh, kind of on both sides of the ball i know you don't have the ball on defense but you're just kind of sloppy with everything and it's not sharp uh you're, you're gonna have a hard time to, to win on the road against a, a very very good team wt all right well it's time to get our legs back under us hit the road to austin and uh, look forward to two big games against uh st ed's to start the conference season absolutely thanks for coming out josh go lions all right